sound like I'm ready. You just woke me up. So get the fuck up. We don't get the money for Bruno today. We're fucked. Where the hell are we going to get our hands on 55 grand, huh? I don't know. We sure as hell ain't going to find it laying around in bed. I got something for starters. A job from Eddie with a big payout. No shit. Yeah, I'll pick you up in a few minutes. So get dressed, grab a gun, and wait for me outside. I'll tell you more in the car. This better not be one of your brilliant ideas, Joe. Hey, I'm not in the mood. Sorry, sorry. I didn't mean to snap at you. I'm still half asleep over here. Yeah, yeah, whatever. So you in or not? Sure, why not? How long till you get here? I'm calling from the gun shop around the corner. I'll be at your place in a minute. All right, I'll wait for you out back. I'll see you soon. With the fancy wheels. Eddie gave it to us just for this job. Nice, huh? You drive. My head's still pounding from last night. We're going to Greenfield. Guess you hit the sauce pretty hard, too, huh? Yeah, I couldn't sleep either. Nothing a bottle of scotch couldn't fix, though. Head over to Greenfield. All right. So now can you tell me what this is all about? We're just gonna drive there, pop some guy, and drive away. Should be a piece of cake. Why? Oh, Eddie said it's a favor for some family from another city. Unfinished business. He gave me this envelope with all the instructions. Said it's gotta be clean, and it's gotta be done today. Why the hell doesn't the other family just do it themselves? Eddie said they've been looking for this guy for a while, and he just found him. They're afraid that if it ain't done right away, the guy's gonna disappear again. Here, here's a picture of him. What'd this guy do? Says here he ratted his family out to the feds. Guy's got it coming to him now. But wait, if he cooperated with the feds, that means he was under protection, right? What if he still is? Even if he is, we're getting paid a few grand for the job. So it's more than worth the risk. Uh, if you say so. Hey, we need every penny we can get right now, right? So after we finish this job, we'll split up and look for other work. All right. Says here they want us to give him a message before we do it. Here, here it is. Okay, got it. Hey, if you see Eddie later, not a word about yesterday. He was never there. Last chink we saw was delivering egg food young. You get it? Yeah, who do you think I am? Some kind of retard? Jury's still out on that one, pal. Just making sure you don't slip up, that's all.
What would you like, sir? Full tank? Full tank, please. Sure thing. Sorry about the prices, but gas keeps going up. It's tough times roll around, you know? Anything else I can do for you, sir? Thank you. Come back anytime, sir. Say? Yeah. All right. Here we go then. Mr. Angelo. Uh, yes? Mr. Salieri sends his regards. Like I said, about six feet game. tall, dark hair, medium build. Those guys over there. <laughs> Shit! Go, go! go. Got a homicide here. Suspect is armed. This is Agent Cox. Right Agent Cox is aboard the Greenfield. Now, goddammit! Those were feds. That asshole really was under protection. And he's famous for conveniently leaving out little details like that. Maybe he didn't know. Don't matter now. We gotta lose him. Oh, fuck. That was close. Get me to Kingston, will you? I got a car waiting there. About the money. Hey, I almost forgot. Eddie paid me in advance, so here's your share. Good luck getting your hair for the money. Come by my place when you're done. Okay. I'll see you later.
You're in luck. These are on sale today. It was a pleasure.